Whew, finally have some blue skies again. All right, I did a bunch of modifications on this uh, a week ago, and it's been raining since then, so I couldn't test it. But, I'm gonna test it right now. I'm gonna think about what I wanna cut here. Hmm, looks like I was cutting this into basically two by fours. Do I wanna do that? All right, let's cut one two by four. Let's finish this cut here. Problem is that a piece of wood gets thinner at this end. Well, no, I can still get decent size that way. All right, let's cut as deep as we can go here. Let's see, okay, looks like it's still lined up. That's good. Yeah, I think I can just lower it a bit and keep going. Hmm. Pretty good. I just discovered that the solar panels for the lumber mill work better when there are no leaves on them. Anyway, I got the leaves off and, you know, cut this guy off. I didn't cut the other side yet. I can do it later. Um, and then I cut a few just strips off to test how it is. And, uh, yeah, it's going through really well. And the surface is nice. Yeah, surface is great. Maybe a... I mean, I can see a little bit of... Uh, blade marks but I think a lot of that has to do with this wood being wet because it's just got it was just rained on for a week so it's wet and that means when I'm cutting it it warps a lot so the blade was kind of binding up in certain spots so I had to back up and go through again um, but even with that I mean there are hardly any there's just there's just very faint saw marks so yeah I'm really happy with this I'm gonna go cut some more stuff Oh, there's a cloud in the way. All right, maybe I won't. <laughs> so several people have mentioned that I could get batteries for the saw. And yes, I, I did think of that, believe it or not. Um, <laughs> but I mean, people say it like, like batteries are just something you pick up on the ground, but like those things are expensive. And then, so I'd have to get a bunch of batteries, which is gonna be thousands of dollars. And then a big charge controller, cause there's gonna be a lot of power going through it. 
and then some kind of speed controller for the motor and all that stuff costs money and adds complexity and maintenance and things break and have to be replaced the thing is right now with this saw it costs me basically nothing to cut a board like i i mean i'll have to replace the saw blade and maybe the brushes on the motor at some point but you know and the, the solar panels will eventually degrade and not really work anymore but like this stuff there, there's so little maintenance like they like what is there right now will last such a long time it probably cost me like less than a cent to cut a two by four you know um but if i add all that stuff that greatly increases the cost it uh, increases the convenience but i'm not running a i'm not i'm not hiring employees who are going to be sitting around doing nothing when you know the saw can't be used um, I'm it's just me doing it. So anytime the sun's out, I can go do some cuts The Sun is blocked by some clouds. I just go work on something else. So it's not a big deal I mean, it's it would be more convenient to have batteries obviously, but yeah, just The the, the cost and the complexity Isn't worth it at least not right now